All right. Hi, my name is DJ Beat, and today we're going to talk about external hard drives and Serato and making sure they always connect with all of your playlists. Um, today, I'm also going to show you how to integrate iTunes and use it to your full advantage. Um, so first, we're going to start in iTunes. We're going to click over here at the top next to the Apple, the iTunes preferences. So the first thing you notice, wait, let's see. We're over here first. Bah, bah, bah. Okay. We come to advance. The first thing we notice is iTunes media folder location. It says users, Mac, music, iTunes, iTunes media. Note that iTunes media is at the very end. You don't want to go anywhere past that. So anytime you see users, Mac, music, that means that's the internal hard drive of your computer. Typically, if you are trying to use an external hard drive, it's because your internal memory is not enough to have all your music, all your videos, and enough memory left over for your Serato to operate. Because once you get like within about five gigabytes of the end of your hard drive, your Serato will start uh, tripping and doing weird stuff. So, in order for us to do this, typically that's off. In order for us to do this, you have to go in here. First of all, you have to plug in your hard drive. Let's see if ours is plugged in. It is not, so I will plug it in now. And it should pop up under devices. So we'll give it a second. There it goes. So inside of here, I have my iTunes library. I'll double click on that. And inside of here, library, what is it? iTunes library extras, library genius, iTunes music library, iTunes media. If I click on there, this is automatically add to iTunes, but that's not what we're looking at right now. Music. And there are all of my artists organized. Okay. So what we now want to do, we want to change from the iTunes here in the hard drive to iTunes. iTunes media and click open so now it's gonna say volumes what I named it DJ beat VJ iTunes iTunes media right so we always want to keep iTunes media folder organized Now, copy files to iTunes media folder when adding to library. That matters for when you're adding new music to your hard drive through your iTunes. I'll explain why that matters later, um, but we're not going to press it right now because we just, if I were to do this, then all the music on my hard drive, once I load it into my iTunes, it will then try and copy from the hard drive, the external hard drive, to your internal hard drive, which is why you wanted an external hard drive in the first place. So leave this off for now. But this is very important. Without this, you your music from your iTunes will not show up in your Serato. Share iTunes library XML with other applications. 
other applications is talking about Serato so make sure you click that one so now we're gonna say okay would you like iTunes to move and rename the files in your new iTunes media folder to match keep iTunes media folder we're gonna say no for now now we're gonna go see so now still there's no you can't find it in there right you have to go to now file add to library iTunes media and then open so now it's gonna add files this is gonna take a long time so I'm gonna pause the video until this is done and we'll be right back 